Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. It is Julie of Julie's Plans and in today's video, I'm going to be planning the week of November 18th through November 24th, but let's go ahead and take a look at this current week. So this past week was our anniversary week and we took a little bit of a staycation starting on Thursday. We went out of town. We actually just went like 30 minutes away, <laughs> but it was a lot of fun. So we got to check out a couple of restaurants that are new to us, even though we've lived here for quite some time. We've never been to Ruth's Chris or Belford's. It was just, it was just such a great time. Um, so here we are on Sunday. Um, I just uploaded a day in the life vlog vlog definitely go check it out my kids are in it and so far the response has been really really good I'm you guys know I've always been a little bit apprehensive about having the rest of my family specifically my kids on the vlog just because I'm, I'm super protective of my kids and I feel like if they're ever going to be on this channel it is going to be of their choosing and it was just such a shock <laughs> that as I'm making dinner, uh, my daughter grabbed the camera and like just pressed record. And honestly, I was a little jealous because I my camera is fairly new to me, and it took me like 10 minutes to figure out where the record button was. <laughs> camera and she just <laughs> grabbed it and started recording and it was just so like raw and and fun and I I loved that they did it the way that they wanted to so I went ahead and included it in the vlog so if you're interested in watching I'll put a little card up here but it is yesterday's video which is yeah now it's yesterday oh my god okay moving on <laughs> okay so we are planning this current week. I am actually going to be using a kit from Cricut Paper Co. I ordered this during the Go Wild collab sale. It is the Thankful Collection kit and it's so, so pretty. I really struggled with, do I save this for next week for Thanksgiving? Do I use it this week? I have a couple kits in mind to use for next week, but my daughter is having a Friendsgiving here at our house on Friday. So I thought, you know what? We'll just do two Thanksgiving spreads. I really don't think that there's any rule against doing that. So <laughs> um, yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. So this kit comes with a lot of stuff. I actually grabbed a few of her script stickers as well. And I'm gonna try to incorporate these wherever they may fit. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started and frame out the week and I will be right back. Okay, so that's so far what I have for the week. I just can't decide if I wanna use habit trackers, all things like that. The great thing about um, Erica's stickers, Erica from Cricut Paper Co, is that her stickers are a repositionable vinyl, which is perfect for someone like me <laughs> because I need all the help I can get. But this kit was, I think primarily made for vertical, which is why the date covers are separate, which I always, always struggled with. But when I saw this kit, I'm just gonna go ahead and just get started while I'm talking. I decided that I wanted to use the glitter headers, if you will. They're not something that I would typically use in an hourly planner, but I just, I like the idea of them and I like the look of them, but you do have to be careful with how you position them in the hourly because the columns are slightly wider than the vertical. But um, another thing I wanted to add is that as we get closer to the holidays, my spreads turn into like almost no white space whatsoever. So the reason why I'm leaving the little bit of a gap up there is because that's where I'm going to put my weather, I'm just gonna continue with these date covers, but 
Um, yeah, I want to leave space for the weather up there. Normally I would find some washi or something that would match with this, but I figured this would be easier and something different. I don't always use all the glittery things in my planner, but like I said, when we get into the holidays, I go like balls to the wall with stickers. <laughs> it gets a little out of the ha out of hand, but it's how I like it. You know, it's like we decorate our homes a little extra for the holidays, so why not decorate our planners, right? So there we go. There are the glitter date covers, and I'll have to show you guys what I did so that I could keep track of how this layout was gonna go. Stay tuned towards the end. I'm gonna show you guys a little cheat sheet <laughs> that I made. You guys will probably think I've lost my mind, but hey, we gotta do what we gotta do. So also another thing before I forget, the two pens that I'll be using this week, I don't even know if I will need my Sharpie pen, but this is the one that I primarily have been using to write in my Erin Condren on the paper. Now, for vinyl stickers, I always use um, a Sharpie fine, ultra fine point permanent marker. This will ensure that they, they dry fast on vinyl, first of all, and then they, they just work great. Don't ever use them directly on the paper, though. That'll be a disaster, but these are great for vinyl and glossy stickers, so. Moving on, uh, what's next? Um, so I've put down my glitter headers. So let's start on Monday because I'm not entirely sure what I wanna do with my sidebar here. And that's usually like at the end or when I'm actually planning, I just start to fill this out as needed. But let's go ahead and start on Monday. Monday, my daughter does work that day. So I think I'm going to use a, she actually has these work stickers. And I think I'm gonna use that to mark her work hours that day. Um, but it's not for me. I wish I only worked from 8 to 12, but that that is not my life. I always have to remind myself to slow down when I'm writing on vinyl stickers because I'm not used to it. I don't use them quite as often, and your hand will slip when you write on them if you're not used to them, or just me. My hand slips, whatever. <laughs> but. Um, I my handwriting can get kind of wonky on them because your the pen or the marker just glides on these stickers. So anyway, moving on, I did want to put down my videos, and I think what I'm going to do is use. I hadn't quite decided which ones I wanted to use for these, but I think. Let me make sure I have all my sheets with me because I I tend to do this. Yes, I have all the sheets with me. So. For the videos, I think what I'm gonna do is use these scalloped event stickers for the ones that are going up this week. Now the main issue is that, obviously this plan with me will be Monday. Sometime this week, we will be able to share our review and you know reveal of the Erin Condren Winter Seasonal Surprise Box. I hope, because it is already pre-recorded, ready to go. Um, but we just have to wait until we're told we can actually share it, which is usually around the time that boxes start shipping and it is scheduled to happen this week. Again, I hope. I also have something else lined up um, that I'm working on with Amy Tangerine, which is super exciting. I will go over that later or in some other video or you guys will just see the video pop up, so. I'm gonna put these down. I'm almost hesitant to write on the sticker. Obviously, I know that today is the plan with me, but part of me wants to leave the other two blank, so that might be what happens. Okay, so those are down. I am gonna go ahead and leave that one blank. This one might actually end up getting moved to Thursday. Actually, let me just go ahead and move it to Thursday right now. Let's see if I can get this up. <laughs> okay, so that's been moved. Next up, I want to, I think I'm gonna put down the decorative boxes that I plan on using for the week. Um, like I said, I get a lot more decorative during the holiday weeks, and this is definitely one of those weeks for us. So I'm gonna lay down all of my decorative boxes first. Thank you. 
So those are down and I kind of already pre-planned in my mind where those would go so that everything else will fit in place. So one of the things that I need to take care of on, I think it was Monday afternoon was the post office because I have a box to send out. Okay, so moving on to Tuesday, one of the, I wouldn't even say it's a big thing, I just have a meeting that I need to, um, my usual one that's at three o'clock, and I think I'm just gonna use this sparkly quarter box thing. <laughs> I'm so not used to using like sparkly boxes or anything like that, in case you couldn't already tell. Okay, and I'm gonna grab one of these stickers from Cricut Paper Co. as well. I just love these. It's like the um, Ray Dunn inspired like text, and it's just, I love it. It's, I don't know, it's one of my favorites. I love that a lot of shops are using it or something similar. I, I love it because honestly, like Ray Dunn is just, I love everything from that brand, all of her stuff. It's just, it's probably a little much, but. <laughs> I love it. So what else? I'm gonna put down my workouts as well for Monday through Wednesday. And I wanna say that I grabbed, yes, thank goodness, I grabbed some of her, I just moved my entire thing, okay. So I grabbed some of her workout stickers and I'm gonna go ahead and use these labels right here and just layer them on there for my workouts. All right, so those are down from Monday through Friday, and then I've got to put a call mom sticker. I'm slacking on the calling of mom, and I really need to get back on track with calling my mom regularly, and I know she watches my videos, so hi mom, I will be calling you. <laughs> All right, so that is down. Next up, I need to schedule some time um, Wednesday night just to catch up on some editing. So I'm just gonna use one of these same smaller, it's not really a half box, it's like a, I don't know what you call this size, cause this is a half box. This is like a three quarters of a half box. <laughs> I'm not even sure. <laughs> And on this sampler sheet, she has like a really cool, like a play button from um, YouTube, and I'm just gonna layer those two together. That works, okay. And then I cannot forget that Wednesday is payday, so I'm gonna go ahead and use, oh, I just saw there was a little package box. I could've used that with the post office. Okay, okay, moving on, I can't, I can't get too focused on that, okay, so. I will use, let's see, what do we have here? I think I'm gonna use one of these and pair it with, let's do this. And did I grab payday stickers from her? Ooh, I did. Even better when you don't have to write something down. <laughs> Okay, so that is done. I still feel like it's not very like cluttered looking. Maybe it's just me, I don't know, I really like it. And the light from my blinds, this is like the in-between parts of the blinds, I just can't get that to go away. Okay, so moving on to Thursday, I think. I had to move my little cheat sheet here. We have to do some potluck prep because I have my potluck at work this day, so I'm going to use, I don't wanna forget about these decorative half boxes up here, so we're gonna do potluck prep with that one. So basically, I'm just gonna get up early before work and just get my stuff ready, um, because I didn't wanna make anything the day prior. I felt like it wouldn't be as fresh, so I'm just gonna get up early. I have something super easy that I'm making, so I'm not too, too worried about it. And then, obviously, our potluck is that afternoon, so I'm going to use another half box, and I think I'm gonna use this orange half box right here. Okay, it is a miracle that that all fit 
on one sticker. <laughs> All right, so that's down. I'm going to go ahead and add another, let's see, we have training that afternoon. And I think I'm gonna use something a little bit smaller and use this lighter blue just to mark that we have training for the rest of that afternoon. Good times. Okay, then, then one of the last things that I need to get put down is, I'm just gonna move this down just a smidge. It kind of works out better that way and it covers up both times there for me, is that we need to get the trash out. Uh, let's see, oh, I also need to put down another workout sticker. So let me grab those, so workout and then trash out. Oh no. <laughs> I swear stickers have a mind of their own. They're just gonna go down however they want to, right? <laughs> All right, where did I put those workout stickers? Here we go. Workout, and I'm really, really trying to work out a little bit more. The holidays are upon us. Things are gonna get serious with food, and I absolutely refuse to cut out food because I'm trying to meet some kind of goal. I know everyone does their health and wellness journey different, but I really want to enjoy the season, all of the food that comes with it, and just kind of know my body, know that that's just gonna require a little bit more working out or things could get disastrous on the scale. <laughs> So, moving on. All right, we're gonna do trash out with, let's use one of these glitter, this one right here. That will work. And I just realized the trash can is the same color as the sticker that I picked, which is not normally what I would have done, but it's a little too late now, which is fine. There we go, trash out. Okay, so, moving on to Friday. Let's see, what do I have? I have my meeting and then a video that I'm not sure what it is, but let's go ahead and mark down the meeting. And I'm gonna go ahead and use this other glitter sticker right here and just mark that meeting. It's actually 8.45, so it's gonna be really close to that sticker right there, but that will be okay. I just love these so much. They're super, super cute. And you know what, I think I'm gonna move it over a smidge because I like to put some Once More With Love uh, munchkins there to express how much I love my work meetings. And of course I always leave those upstairs so it'll just get added later. So moving on, on Friday is when Kayla's um, Friendsgiving is and I wanna use, let's see, Something that I wanted to do really quick was clean up the house, but I want to use a decorative um, box for her sticker and that, or for her event, and that's going to take priority. So I think I'm going to use. Aha! This is the sheet I was looking for. I want to use. I think we will go with this one for Kayla's friends giving, and I will have to figure out how to fit that in here. <laughs> Okay, that did not turn out well at all. So we are gonna move on to another sticker. Oh my God, I kinda knew this was gonna happen. Okay, let's try again. Okay, that's as good as it's gonna get. <laughs> my hand plus vinyl plus slipperiness is not always a good mixture, but I don't think it's too, too bad. I'm just gonna put that there, and then I am going to use from the sampler this little like spoon fork thingamabob. There we go, that's not too bad. Okay, so I did wanna put like tidy up house right here. I just need to find a quarter box that will work, and I think I will just use one of these. What color do we want to use? Let's. Let's use this Toby color. I think that that'll look nice. Not too bad. So we will do a little quick cleanup before everyone comes on over. It's gonna be potluck style, which is gonna be super cool. I'm excited that she's doing this for her friends. I think it's awesome. And hopefully there's not too much cleanup on my end afterwards. <laughs> 
Okay, so moving on to the weekend, I need to remember to put down my weekend sticker. Whew. And it is getting warm for some reason while I am filming this. Who knows why? And I'm just gonna try to, I think I'm gonna have to white out some of the times. They just kind of bug me when I'm putting down a weekend sticker. They're just so intrusive. <laughs> but now they are gone, and that is so crooked. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, let's see if this is kind of better, maybe. It's still crooked, whatever. It's actually not that bad. Okay, it's fine. It's totally fine. Okay, so I am going to put down two more workout stickers. Um, I'm not definitely not gonna do anything on Friday because I don't really have a chance to work out before work and it's just not gonna happen Friday night with Kayla having guests over, so we'll just call that a rest, a rest day. I cannot say the word rest to save my life. Probably because I don't actually know how to rest. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna put both of those on Saturday and Sunday morning. I definitely love that I can work out earlier in the day on the weekends. I could do it on the weekdays, I just choose not to, so. That's totally on me. Okay, those are down. Let's see what's next. I need to do groceries Saturday morning or order them for Saturday morning is what I actually need to do. And I think that I will use this same skinnier label, but use it over here for the groceries on Sunday. Or maybe I'll use this orange. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, that came out a little wonky too, but <laughs> it's gonna be the theme of this plan with me. Everything's coming out a little wonky. Okay, so there is the groceries, and I realized once again, I have forgotten to, to check when our, basket, our basketball, good Lord, when our football teams are playing. So November 24th for the, oh, oh, that's right. <laughs> Oh my God, here we go. Our teams are playing each other. This is gonna be a problem in the Garza household. One of us will be sleeping on the couch. It won't be me, people. Heads up, it will not be me. So now the question is, do I put both down? Do I just, you know, I, what do I do? Hmm. <laughs> Well, oh man, this is tough. This one actually looks better with this week than this one does. But this is my team, and this is my planner, damn it. So, <laughs> maybe I'll give Jesse the other one. We're putting my team down. Too bad, so sad. Moving on. <laughs> oh, it is gonna be a rough week here. They haven't played each other in years, I believe. That went down crooked. Ugh, and her stickers are not repositionable. But, oh, maybe they are. Hang on, I've never really had to move one. Our teams haven't played each other in a while, and we don't watch sitting on the same couch. It's that serious. <laughs> Oh my God, I totally forgot that that was coming up. This is, oh, okay. Moving on. <laughs> so I need to film Saturday evening and edit Sunday evening. That's how we're gonna do things. So I think I'm just gonna use, I really wanna use up these decorative boxes here. So I am going to use those. Just keeping it very, very simple. Next week, I'll probably be filming a lot of things to prep for December, like December's plan with me, things like that. Um, I don't think that I'm gonna do Vlogmas in the sense that everyone else does Vlogmas. I'm seriously just thinking of making it um, one vlog per week, like all the days condensed, and it'll be like Vlogmas week one, and then Vlogmas week two, and so on and so forth. So let me know what you guys think about that. I just don't, I think with me working full time and things like that, I really don't have the capacity or the time to really vlog every single day, edit, upload. That stuff's a lot of work, and I have nothing but praise for anyone who can manage to do that, but that is definitely not something that I see myself having on 
on my schedule just yet. I never wanna say never because I say never and then I do it and then people are like, oh my God, you said you were never gonna do that. People keep track of what you say, apparently. <laughs> Ooh, I forgot to show you guys this. So this was the cheat sheet that I used to prep for this plan with me. I basically made a photocopy of my planner, washi taped these two pages together so that basically it would look the same. And then it helped me with the placement of all the stickers. I don't know if I will do this every single week, but it was definitely helpful when using stickers from a sticker shop that I don't use quite as often, like Planner Kate or Chrissy and Designs. I know there are sticker sheets like the back of my hand, and sometimes when I'm using a new kit or new shop, and Cricut Paper Co. isn't new to me, but I don't use her stickers quite as often, then I need a little bit more help to keep the plan with me from completely going off the rails and just <laughs> making no sense. So I hope that that was helpful. So that is everything for this plan with me for this week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you are new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope that you will stick around and subscribe. If you are already subscribed to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I do post new videos every single week. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.